our God is a transgenerational God. The fact that he's the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob tells me one thing. He wants his revival to pass on from generation to generation to generation. Oh, come on. You believe that? Give the Lord a big hand. Hallelujah. Sewaktu saya di SOT, Pastor Kong pernah berkata bahwa kekristenan bukanlah sebuah agama, tetapi sebuah hubungan dengan Tuhan yang nyata dan hidup. Itulah yang saya lihat dan belajar selama saya di SOT. Itu juga menjadi rema dalam hidup saya, secara konstan mengingatkan saya untuk menjadi pribadi yang lebih baik. Bukan hanya menjadi seorang Kristen dan pemimpin yang lebih baik dalam pelayanan saya, tetapi juga menjadi seorang putri yang lebih baik untuk orang tua saya dan seorang ibu yang lebih baik untuk putra saya. Ibu saya selalu mengatakan kepada saya akan pentingnya untuk masakan Tuhan buat diri saya sendiri. Satu hal yang diajarkan adalah membangun altar saya sendiri kepada Tuhan setiap hari. Hal ini menjadi sangat nyata buat saya tahun ini di SOT, karena sekarang saya tahu dan sangat yakin buat Tuhan itu nyata dalam hidup saya. I was in the SOT back in 2011, and I fell in love with missions. I saw for myself how one person can really make a difference. Today, I still go for a few mission trips every year. I'm very proud that Gary is graduating from SOT, and I know that this year of training has prepared him to be an effective minister for God. In the mission field is where all the training that we've gotten from SOT goes through the real test. It was not like our mock cell groups, but we were surrounded by the familiar faces of our team members who responded positively to our preaching even if we said the wrong things. In the mission field, it was up to us to bring the love and the presence of God to those we are ministering to. It was quite nerve-wracking, but as I preached for the first time to about 100 people, I knew that we were flowing with the Holy Spirit and His presence really showed up. When I saw people coming down the aisles to respond to the altar call, I couldn't help but thank God for working both in me and through me. I was a little concerned when Stephanie told me she wanted to enroll in SOT this year because she has to juggle work, SOT and her many dance performances. But I'm glad she took the step of faith to be trained in the things of God. I know that she is and will always be in His good hands. It was a step of faith for me to enroll in the SOT this year because I had to take a pretty big pay cut. But I'm glad I did it. This year has been a year of many breakthroughs. I experienced financial provision, became a Connect Group coordinator, and learned to move in spiritual gifts. I know that it's not by my own strength, but only through the power of God. It has been a mind-blowing time at the SOT this year. It was one thing to hear about it from my parents, but to personally experience the moving of the Holy Spirit, to see the healing miracles take place, and to learn practical ministry from the anointed pastors and leaders was beyond what I had imagined when I first signed up for SOT. I'm ready to take all that I've learned back to my youth group and inspire them to love God more. In 2007, I graduated from SOT and incorporated the Bible study curriculum into my ministry work in the New Caris Mission. The practical teaching on church life and ministry also play a big part of how I do discipleship and training now. We are so happy that Vivian has gone through the training this year, and I know that she has grown stronger in the Lord because of that. Together, we will grow the Kingdom of God. SOT 每一天的教导启发了我,帮助我成为更刚强的基督徒。我已经在化妆施工服侍了十二年。My mom really inspired me to serve God. I grew up in Harvest Kids and have been serving as a cell group guitarist for 12 years. This year in SOT, I was really equipped to do so much more. I had the opportunity to join and be trained in the SOT band. I'm very thankful to the pastors and leaders for giving me the chance to step out in faith for believing in me and for guiding me along. I used to think that being a Christian is very easy because my siblings and I grew up in a Christian home. 
But now, I know that was only possible because of the strong spiritual values my parents instilled in us from young. I no longer take my relationship with God for granted and I know that it's my responsibility to take up this mantle and pass on this legacy to my children. 神是我们家庭的中心，我们对神的这份爱，是我们希望可以传给我们的孩子和孙子的。我们向SOD是为了在属灵知识上受装备，因为我们知道教养我们的孩子行在神的道路上是非常重要的。因此，我们很开心，我